Hi, my name is Diane Givens Moffitt and I served as Executive Director for Harbor House from 1992 to 1995 enjoyed that ministry immensely. It was uh, spiritually enriching and just the things that we were able to do for the community and with the community uh, were just outstanding for me. I think one of my fondest memories though uh, was with the children's choir. I remember uh, we were teach teaching the children um, and they looked like the United Nations. We had all, you know, people of color, Hispanic, Latinx, we had Asian, we had um, African American, uh, we had white siblings. I just, it's, it was amazing, just a group of, 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 of uh, children there. But anyway, we were having a hard time getting them settled down and my daughters who were in high school came through. And of course they were, uh, they had been performing throughout the Bay Area, singing and playing and so forth, the Moffat sisters. And so they came in and Eustacia played the piano and Jessica was the director and they got these kids together. <laughs> I mean, for some reason, they didn't give them any trouble. They got them and we started going all over Oakland um, and I would share the story of Harbor House and the children's choir would sing. That was a really sweet ministry. The other thing, and I remember the store, Many Hands, Many Lands on Grand Avenue. We had a wonderful location, and we would take some of the crafts and the artistry of those who had come, some of the refugees that had come from Southeast Asia, uh, who are our friends and partners in ministry. Uh, they would do their crafts, and we had quilting, and different people would bring things in, and we were able to uh, sell those. Uh, and I think shortly later, we opened another business, because we were seeking to employ those uh, to give them a livable wage uh, so that they would be able to earn money and support their families. I love that about Harbor House because we were open to everyone and uh, really bearing witness to Christ in our words and in our deeds. I was spiritually enriched and inspired by empowering the community. I remember that that is so important to Jesus. So I thank you for your ministry bearing witness to Christ, the love and the justice and the mercy that has come through Harbor House for 50 years. And so on your 50th anniversary, I just want to say, uh, God bless you. Continue to do the work. It is definitely needed uh, in this world.